Hey guys, welcome back. This is PhilPronTheCage.com and this is WD Easy Store. Um, they are mostly available from Best Buy and they're selling it for $2.99. That's the original price, but they usually have it discounted as $199.99. But if you're lucky, you should be able to get it for $159.99. Now, that's a very affordable price for an eight terabyte of external hard drive, but there's even something better about the Easy Store eight terabytes, and let's get right into it. So here is the reflet that says, hello, how you connected, you just connected. There's a power, there's a USB cable, and you're done. If you want more functions, there is a double discovery, double backup, or double drive utilities that you can use more features out of it. But here is the drive itself, so this is, the WD A terabyte Easy Store. Now the Easy Store isn't even listed on the WD homepage. That means it's mostly sold outside of their network, and that's why you get some heavy discounts on it. And here is the power adapter, USB cable, and some warranty card, and some liability waivers right there. So here is the drive itself and the thing about this drive is that it's got a WD red drive built inside that is usually used for the NAS network attached storages and the thing even better is that this is a lot cheaper than the hard drive it has inside sold separately so you might as well just better get this and extract the drive out of it and let me show you how to do that And after the processes, you should be left with this. This is the hard drive it has, WD Red. Depending on your luck, you should be having either 128 megabytes of cache or 256 megabytes of cache. I got lucky. Anyway, SATA standards and NAS 3.0 Red, so it should be a lot more stable, although not that fast at 5400 RPM. If you made this far, then the rest is fairly easy. You just slide it open like that, slide the drive out of it, and you're done. So here is a hard drive that is even more expensive than the external drive enclosure combined. And what you're left with is a controller attached right there. So you just pull out four screws, one, two, three, four, and additional screw with the controller right there, and then you should be done. Um, you should be able to plug in other hard drive back to the enclosure if you manage not to break every single part of it and continue using it as just a simple external hard drive. So that was the quick look and unboxing at the, what used to be the WD Easy Store 8 terabytes and what's included in the enclosure. Keep an eye on the discounts, but even without the discounts, they're usually throwing in the 100 bucks discounts available anyway. So that still is a pretty good deal for the 8 terabytes of hard drive it bears inside. Thank you always for watching. If you have any questions, please put them down in the comments. You can always meet us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. And we'll see you guys later. Ciao.